I've had a few people contact me here lately and ask about budget-friendly camping stoves for families. And so I got to thinking, I did one a while back, top five stoves, under $100. And so I was like, what if a family doesn't have $100 and they want a camping stove? Let me see what I can find. So I started looking on Amazon because I was like, most people use Amazon. Let's not do Timu or something like that. Let's just go straight with Amazon. And basically, it's really hard to find a camping stove that's two burners for under 50 bucks. So I was like, all right, I'll bump it up to 60. So camping stoves under $60. So my criteria was I wanted two burners and I found some, not a lot. So there's also some one burner stoves. I did not get little backpacking stoves or the little um, jet stoves and things like that. There are some one burners and there's a couple two burners. Let's just get into it. So we're gonna start out with these single burner stoves here. And I'll start off with the one that I think is the best deal. It's rated pretty decent. It comes with cans of fuel. There's different kinds of combo packs. And so for the most bang for your buck, if you wanna go with just a single burner stove, then this is the one that I would get, but always get what's best for you, right? So anyway, over here's a couple more of the stoves. As you see, I'm gonna put the price of everything here and we will also have the link and the name of the product in the description below so that you can check them out. So the main reason why I'm a big fan of having two burner stoves for family camping is because with the one burner, you're cooking one thing at a time. Let's say you're making breakfast for the family and you wanna make bacon and eggs. Well, with one burner, you're cooking the eggs, then you're cooking the bacon, or you're cooking the bacon, and then you're cooking the eggs, and then one of them is cold by the time the other one gets done. So at least with a two burner stove, you can cook two things at once. And ideally, you might be eating warm food all together. So here's the two burner stoves that I found that I thought were a decent price of course, Coleman coming right under the 60 bucks. I mean, Coleman is a name brand that middle of the line stuff, but it always works, right? You see Coleman everywhere. And some of these other stoves are a little cheaper. Don't really know the names of the company, but we think about the construction of a stove. What is it? It's a gas line going into a gas source that has a flame for you to cook. So. I mean, for the most part, you could probably build one yourself. I wouldn't recommend it. I would definitely buy one. But if you're like, I just want the cheapest thing for me and my family, I don't even know if we want to go camping. So then check out the single burners or if you want the double burner, which I highly recommend, then look at some of the cheaper models. And if you like it, you can always graduate up in a year or two to something a little more your style. So to wrap it up and be totally honest with you, you don't need to spend 100, 200 or more on a simple camping stove for you and your family, especially if you're just starting out. Just find some basics, check out all the ones that we've listed in this video. Um, maybe even look at the other video, the top 10 stoves over $100 right here. That uh, You'll actually see a couple of the stoves from this video in there, but just know that you don't have to have the top of the line thing to get going. So that's it. Hopefully if you can find something that you like. Let us know in the comments what you think.